Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So still in chapter 7 now. Hello Al Kane. I mean Camel. And this topic consists of two subtopics, 7.1 and 7.2. And then in this particular video, we're gonna focus on 7.1, introduction and nomenclature of Hello Al Kane. At the end of this topic, you should be able to name Hello Al Kane according to IP nomenclature, give the structural formula for Hello Al Kane's, and then classify Hello Al Kane's into primary, secondary, and tertiary, and describe Hello Al Kane as compound that contain polar bond and the carbon-bearing halogen are susceptible for a nucleophilic attack. Okay, mari kita mulakan. Haloalkyl also known as alkyl halide. So, general formula dia adalah CnH2n plus 1 X ataupun simply Rx, okay? methyl X. Okay, contoh. And the functional group is, of course, halogen. Haloalkyl can be classified into four different class sebenarnya. Okay? Yang first ni adalah methyl halide. Okay? Sebab dia tidak ada... R group attached to that carbon yang melekat dengan X, okay. Yang kedua tu adalah primary, so ada satu R group attached to the carbon yang ada X tu. And then yang second ni adalah secondary haloalkanes. And last but not least adalah tertiary haloalkanes. So class dia adalah based on how many alkyl group attached to the carbon yang ada X tu. Alright. Now let's try name the haloalkane. Kita ada 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 di sana. So parent, untuk yang pertama ni adalah pentane. Sebab ada 5 carbon as the parent. And then, kita ada 2 anak di sana. Methyl dan juga bromo. So kalau kita numberkan dia ikut warna biru ni. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then another option is from the right sana. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So kalau kita bagi nama macam ni. Kita kira locans. Untuk warna hitam, total locans adalah 7. And then untuk warna biru, total locans adalah 2 plus 3 equals to 5. So obviously kita akan pilih warna biru. So the full name is. 3 bromo 2 methyl pentane as the parent. Alright, next compound ni kita ada cyclic di tengah-tengah tu as the parent. So it is cyclohexane and then kita ada anak di sana bromo and then chloro and also that one is isopropyl I believe. So kita bagi nombor dulu. Nombor dia adalah 1 2 3 4 5 6 okey warna biru or black 1 2 3 4 5 6. Okay, obviously kita tidak akan letak uh, isopropyl as carbon pertama sebab dia akan menyebabkan lokan jadi besar. Okay, so kalau kita ambil dua ni, okay, kiraan anak dia untuk warna hitam 1 plus 2 plus 5 ya guys, sebenarnya sana 8. Okay, in while kalau warna biru tu pula 1 plus 2 plus 4 is gonna be 7, so obviously kita akan pilih warna biru juga. So the full name would be 1 bromo, 2 chloro, 4 methyl, cyclohexane. Okay. Alright, let's go to the complex, more complex one. Ini adalah aromatik ya. So, dia ada benzin di tengah-tengah. So, obviously, parent dia adalah benzin ya. Sebab priority kan, lebih tinggi daripada yang lain-lain tu. So, anak dia ada chloro, and ada bromo, and also ada ini. Ah, kita tambah sikit-sikit. Okay, dia adalah sekbutil. Alright. So, you may try this question and give me the answer in the comment section. Alright. Now, last part of the video, let's talk about reactivity of haloalkane. So, cerita dia, okay, haloalkane dia ada... X sebagai dia punya functional group and dalam C dengan X ni X is more electronegative sangat-sangat electronegative compared to carbon so that's why X tu akan jadi partially negative and the carbon will be partially positive because of that and that is also the reason why CX bond ini adalah polar bond and because of that too C yang partially positive ini adalah electrophile suka elektron so dia electrophilic site and menyebabkan dia lebih senang di attack oleh nucleophile so kita akan tengok di the next video how does haloalkane react chemically and two main reaction yang akan berlaku untuk haloalkane adalah nucleophilic substitution and also elimination